We receive birds in a number of different ways. Uh, sometimes we get them from the colonies, that the public can also um, give us a call and we'll go out and fetch the bird. And sometimes the public bring the birds to us. When they arrive, they'll go through to the veterinary section. The veterinarian will look over the bird, see what's wrong, make a diagnosis, put them onto a treatment that's required. So they get numbered so that we can track the bird through the rehabilitation process. And once all that's done, then the healing starts. We have over 170 birds in the area that I'm working in. Each of those birds will be checked on in the morning, make sure that everything looks good, and then they will get a series of fish, water, formula, and darrows throughout the day to make sure they're gaining weight so that they can move along in the rehabilitation process. We have lots of partners, such as the Georgia Aquarium. I've even been to Georgia Aquarium and met the people there. Zoos and aquaria are critical in today's society. Not only do they provide staff and support to conservation projects, but they are enormous contributors to projects through funding them. It's those type of partnerships and, and the work we do, the full package that makes it such a wonderful job.